this looks an awful lot like an early bus. <laughs> <laughs> and then I thought, well, what the hell? I'll just give him, you know, I'll just give pay homage to him, do his props and, and move on. I don't know if I'll ever do another one again, but maybe, but it was it was uh, about half of the thing I thought, holy cow, this is really this is really bringing really me off. He was speaking to you. Yeah, I must admit. <laughs> But since, uh, since you're willing to talk about sure. shapes, the, in the center on the right, it's like a hat. Yeah, something. yeah. Well, yes. You, you know, see that in several places. Yeah, yeah. But you, you see these things around. Since my town is an agricultural town, I mean, that's really what it is. I mean, it's, uh, and you'll see, you know, people, you know, will, will, will actually have these big broad rim, rim hats that they lay down. I mean, it's, it's exactly what it is. Mm -hmm. Uh, and you see them out of context, like on a table as you're walking by. Uh, you know, when you're looking straight down, I mean, suddenly it, it does it becomes something besides a hat, and who knows, you know, what it is. Uh, and I, you know, I, that happens every now and then where I see something, I'm like, what in the hell is that? What is that? You know, and then I, as I investigate, sort of, it becomes obvious what it is. You know, uh, yeah, that's what's happening. But it also has. I mean, you know, the other thing was with, you know, that I've been neatly skirting with these be addresses. I mean, there's lots of sexual references, too. And that sort of takes on, 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 on genitals and, and phalluses and so forth and so on around, you know, around the painting. Uh, the, uh, this, 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 these, uh, these shapes here that are something that are, that are ubiquitous, that are almost, um, you know, in most of my paintings. You know, when I was a little boy, we lived on the Mexican border down in California, and my, my uncle and dad had a ranch. And we used to go out at night to, uh, for night irrigation. And I'd go out right around with my father. And it was this enormously flat landscape. There wasn't, there wasn't a hill inside. It just goes on forever flat, it seems like. And there'd be these gigantic palm trees out on, on an irrigation pitches. And I, you know, I must have been about three, four, something like that. And I mean, I honestly, I'd never seen anything so tall in my life, particularly in that, in that landscape. And it's still, it's still impressive me when I see these long, you know, big tall trees and, and you know, these, these uh, you know, the cypress trees that you see in it, they just go with it. Of course, they are the symbol of the, of the, of the, of the unification of heaven and earth because they grow straight up so quickly, um, you know, and, uh, and so they're, they're ubiquitous. Here. 